Now, as customers complain, this computer takes too long to turn on. There is a lot of uh, dust inside, but we'll see what happens. I got the button down. The light's on in the back, but it's not turning on. I'm gonna guess it's in this power supply here. I'm gonna hold this button down and see how long it takes. Taking over 50 seconds. Well, anyway, I'm going to blow this out. I'm going to take this power supply out. There's only four screws on the back. I'm going to take this power supply apart. Now you can see that it's cleaner. Now I take the responsibility for your actions if you take this power supply apart. I got it out of the computer there is potential high voltage in this. If you follow my instructions, you should not get any damage done to yourself. But if you just blindly do it, and you, you could possibly hurt yourself. So, there's a sticker here that says guaranteed void if removed. So, you voided your warranty if you remove the cases from the screw. This computer is four years old. I'm not worried about the warranty. With that being said, there's four screws here. Take it off. Got a lot of dust in here too. Now you're gonna find you're gonna look for is capacitors. You see this that guy right there is like that's a capacitor. Well, there's one right here. In my tutorial how to identify bad capacitors, you'll be able to see how to identify that. See it's got a peak to it, it's round at the top. He's bad. And there's a couple over here. One that's blatantly bad, you can see the, the guts coming out of it. And let's see, get off the screwdriver. That one right there is bad, and that one over there is bad, between the two screws. And the small one is even bad down there. So we're looking at one, two, three, four, five capacitors being bad. Now I have to take this wire cabling to cut that cut this off with wire cutters. There might even be a bad capacitor. There is one right here. I don't know if it's bad or not. Can't really tell. With this confetti of wires. There's bad capacitors will cause power supplies to take long to charge up and turn on your computer. I don't think that one's bad. No, he works fine. So five capacitors. Keep in mind, with a negative on here, which is a black circle, 
It goes with the white line with the negative on the capacitor. That one's a thousand microfarad, ten volt. The other one is probably yep, a thousand microfarad, ten volt. That one's a thousand microfarad, ten volt down here. This one here, I mean. I would have to take out to see. But he's bad, you can see the guts. In order to take it out, you need to take these two screws, these four screws out for this computer fan. Take a grounding strap off here. And we take that screw here, and there, and each corner down here. And this is going to pop out. You're not going to be able to disconnect it from the power on this side. So it'll just fold out. Be careful, don't touch these guys here. They will shock you. And it's not going to be fun. Alright, now let's see what happens. I got the capacitor to change. Power lights on. Turn it on first try. Awesome. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.